Yo, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Killer Shine, back again with another episode of the Pokemon X Wonderlock. Uh, we're just continuing through this uh, route and everything. We're about to jump on Rhyhorn and, yeah, go to this cave and see what's good. So, tune in. Um, you know, let's let's go ahead and get into this episode. Hope you guys are enjoying it right off the bat. Please, if you have not yet, throw those thumbs up at me. Also, if you have not yet, please hit that sub button. So, let's get into it. So big news with the Pokemon um, world nowadays, man. We got a new anime coming up. We got some new leaks of uh, Rock Ruff's evolutions. Um, just a whole lot of craziness right now, man. We got these Ultra Beasts going on. Um, I'm really hyped, man. It's going to be really interesting to see how a lot of this stuff is panning out, man. So my question for you guys today is how do you, how do you guys feel about there being alternate evolutions um, in these games um, you know considering you only get exclusive evolutions through sun and moon so and we also discovered too that um, uh, you know not only do rock rough um, rock roughs evolutions uh, depending on the game you get also your starters too if I'm not mistaking so I don't even know why I did that that was kind of a waste of time but we're gonna go ahead and back it up and then, okay, right horn. There we go. Yeah, this is. There we go. Anyways, so how do you guys, you know, think that's gonna play out? Like, I mean, are you guys interested in seeing like you know different evolutions rather than just seeing the same old ones over and over? I mean, it's pretty amazing. Not only that, you're gonna get exclusive Pokemon in each game. So I know like uh, the totem Pokemon are different. Like for example. You get the um, um, the Alolan Raticate as the totem Pokemon, and then you get Gummy Shoes on another one. So that's pretty awesome. I mean, how do you guys feel about that concept? Like that's that's kind of a really cool concept. At the same time, it's kind of like you know they're doing a lot of these amazing uh, different things on these games, and I mean it's it's gonna it's gonna be interesting. How do we mount off of this guy? Okay, we want off. All right, there we go. So we're going to go ahead and battle this person. See what they're about. Oh, I guess she doesn't want to battle. Okay. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and go in here. Um, I don't really know what we're looking for at the moment. I just think that we're just running around trying to find the person that we're supposed to battle. Hopefully we find that person and quick. So this is kind of confusing. <laughs> I haven't played this game in a while. So like I said, it's always, I, I love going back to these games after I haven't played them in such a long time and kind of run through them. Oh, something's in our face. What do we got? Ooh, oh yeah, we get to catch the next Pokemon actually, matter of fact, since we're in this cave. So let's go ahead and do that. Um, let's, I hope. Yeah, I don't think we'll knock it out. So let's let's go with Bubble. Maybe Bubble won't knock this one shot this thing. Oh, oh, perfect. Okay, it's got sturdy. Perfect. So that helps, dude. It's got Stealth Rocks. What? It's got a Rocker already. So let's go ahead and catch this thing and want to trade it off and see what we get. Um, hopefully we get something decent. But so far, I mean, we're trying to get to that second badge. I'm really, really excited. I want to get to the second badge already. Nice, we catch it. And, you know, um, I, I'm just I'm just stoked, man. I'm stoked for everything that's coming abroad. Like, you know, we got the new games. The series, I'm not really too hyped about, man. I'm like, they're talking about, you know, Ash going back to school, which is cool. And I, and I like that concept, but I don't know. I, I kind of I saw a couple of... Um, you know things of the trailers and it, it just looks kind of like I don't know it just looks weird to me I mean I, I can't knock it until I watch it so I'm not gonna put too much you know bash on it but just from what I've seen so far I'm not too thrilled but you never know I mean you know they can always have some really good surprises and everything and you know the, the anime might actually be really decent um, so let's go ahead and want to trade Onyx out and see what we get Hopefully we get something cool, um, but yeah, um, the games though. I'm just I'm so ready for the games, you know, and you know, and especially with the new system too. 
like Yannex. I wonder how that's going to pan out with everything, you know. And so we got someone from Missouri. Let's go. Mac Rocks. So Mac Rocks, if you're watching this, shout out to you, man. Um, but yeah, definitely, like, I, I just, I'm just so ready to, to you know, have, have like, and then that's another thing, too. They were talking, um, ooh, ooh, nice. A Tyrantrum, that's cool. I, I actually think we're going to be taking one of these things on pretty soon, so not bad. Rock Dragon, we need, that's a, that's, that's a good type to have. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm, re I'm really, are they were talking, speculating that, they, that, that might be the end of Ash. I mean, they're, they're thinking about, you know, seeing him grow up and, you know, wonder, I wonder how that's going to pan out. Like, is he going to grow up? Is he going to like, you know, finally be, be off the show? Like, what's. What is there to, you know, what, what's going on? Oh, we don't need to battle this guy. We're just going to go ahead and, and ditch it. But, yeah, like, cool, Hearthstone. Um, you know, like, if he does leave the show, like, where do they go from there? Like, what happens? Like, you know, who, who takes over? Does, does he grow up? Does he have kids? Like, what is going to happen? And I know that everybody was, they were really, really wanting Serena to stay on the show. And she's not, unfortunately. There's a new girl. But that's not really a shocker. I mean, Ash is a player. How many girls has, has he, you know, had his adventures with throughout these years? I mean, there's so many. So, I mean, it's, it's you know, it was cool to kind of see, like, him go through all this stuff. And, you know, and it sucks that we're not going to see, like, you know, some of the older people, like, that I remember, like, Misty and all that. And, um, you know, I'm, I'm from the old school, um, you know, and it's, it's just, it's weird. Like, you know, Brock and, you know, we don't even see Gary, like, you know, he has so many like, different rivals now and just the whole general, like, uh, thing is just, it's kind of changing. Um, so how do you guys feel about that as far as, uh, rivals and, you know, traveling partners? Um, do you guys think that, you know, they should, they should always change it up? Or do you think that they should kind of keep someone that's there for him the whole time? Or should they bring back some of the old characters? I mean, I think it's kind of funny, though. Like, they're bringing in characters, but alternate kind of ways. Like, the, the new Professor Oak is, you know, his cousin. And it looks just like him, but, you know, dark. And he's got, like, long hair and long hair don't care kind of style. He's like a surfer, Professor Oak. Which is cool. But at the same time, it's like... It's kind of funky, like it's it's kind of weird. But I mean, I I I don't know. I just think that you know that all these changes that they're making, like what are they trying to do now? Like what are they going for? What are they aiming for? As far as uh, you know, the show, like you know, with the whole series and everything, like I, I hope Pokemon isn't towards its end. It doesn't look like it's going anywhere in time soon. It's still very highly relevant, and a lot of people love it. But at the same time, it's like, you know, you could only do so much. Um, but, you know, who knows? Like, I, I just hope that they don't get all gimmicky and kind of turn it into, like, Digimon and all that kind of, you know, deal. I don't think people would really like that. Like, I know I wouldn't. I mean, I, I'd want it to stay kind of, you know, the way it is, but have some kind of cool outcome to it. Okay, where are we? Oh, who's this guy? What is this? You don't want it, fam. Well, well, what do we have here? A nosy little trainer who's come poking around. Listen up, we're the fashionable team whose name makes people tremble in fear. Team Flair. Team Flair's goal is to make, and so we're all the only ones who are happy. We don't care a bit, one bit about what happens to other trainers or Pokemon. So get out of here, kid. Don't you know not to play with fire? Uh, we're gonna go with no, because <laughs> we're dangerous like that. Get in my, get in my fancy scary. Wait, getting my fancy suit dirty isn't the stylish way to do things, but it, it all obliterates you. Get him, Houndor. Oh, dude, you got a Houndor? That's that's garbage, fam. You about to get bodied by my freaking uh little frog right here? Let's go, frog deer. Yo. We're about to end this dude's day really quickly. So at least you get to go home to your family real quick and uh, let them know you got smashed by a little kid. Yeah, one-shotted. I don't want it, man. 
They don't want it. Zubat. So we're going to go ahead and should we switch into something else? Um, actually, we'll stay in. We're almost to the next level. So let's go ahead and take the Zubat out. We're going to go ahead and water pulse it. Hopefully get the confusion off. Oh, we don't even need to. This thing got one shot. Yo, Frogadier is not playing. He is putting in that work. Destroyed. But then again, this guy was a weenie, so. Also, too, man, the um, the new, uh, like, bad team, Team Skull. What is this? You're pretty tough. Pokemon trainer for a kid. But watch yourself. I'm not the only uh, member of Team Flare. Ha. Huh. We don't, we're not scared of you, dude. I mean, you just got, you got taken up the game. We're going to talk to everyone else down. So we're, uh, we're going to take everyone else down so we can do what we want. Well, good luck with that. This is going to send out, uh, what is that thing called? A gulpin? So gulpin is, yeah, poison type. So we'll be able to take this thing out. Water pulse it. Oh, and we get the confusion. Let's go. Frogadare is putting in that work. Oh, it's using Amnesia. So it's uh, special defense is going to rise. So we got a physical attack or two. So it's quick attack. That should. Oh, that doesn't really do any damage either. It's going to use Yawn on me. We're going to quick attack again. Knock this thing out. But I think Frogadare is going to go to sleep, though. So we can switch out. Hopefully he, just, he won't. He thinks he's gonna be asleep though. Yep. So we're gonna switch out though. We're gonna have to. What is he gonna have? An electric. Oh, yeah. We're gonna switch into. Um. Let's go to Charmeleon. Charmeleon's gonna be able to put in some work on this thing. So he sends out his electric. We're gonna go ahead and hit this thing with Dragon Rage. And just, oh, we're almost take it out. Did I use Roar? I don't know, Howl. Well, that's not going to do you any good, bro, when you're about to be knocked out. We don't play. We don't play. So I, I think I'm going to have to start leading with um, Charmeleon. But yeah, Team Skull, and I forgot what the other team's name is, but... I kind of have a feeling like Team Skull is going to be the good guys for some reason. And the other team is going to be the bad guys. Just because of the simple fact that like the Ultra Beasts kind of resemble a lot of their members. So, I don't know. We're looking for fossils. Discover a kid. Discover a kid. Yeah, let's discover a kid. Two members, two player. You want to team up? Let's do it. Let's go. Just wanted to make people team player happy. Why don't you just do that? But if you're going to be around threatening other people, we won't let you get away with it. Nope, we won't. We're about to handle this business. So we got a two on uh, two on two. We're gonna use a crow gunk and a scraggy. Got an esper. Got my charmeleon. Um, let's go ahead and dragon rage one of these things. We're gonna go for crow gunk. And, oh, we almost knocked it out. Just putting up screens. Really, bro? Oh, that's going to hurt. Headbutt. Headbutt's not going to really do anything. We're going to go ahead and use Dragon Rage on Scraggy and hopefully knock this thing out. Nope. COVID. Oh, got one of them knocked out. So Krogan goes down. Let's go. And we're going to level up. Let's go. Do, do. Oh, and then down goes her Esper. Sorry, Esper. Can't be using those those weak attacks. And it's got Moxie. Uh-oh. So, oh, she's got a Frogadier. Oh, is that my, that's my Frogadier, I think. So we're going to go ahead and just use Dragon Rage again. And down goes Scraggy. So... They weren't trying to have it. We weren't having it. We had to put them down real quick for the count. Yeah, that's right. On your fizz. Don't don't don't. 
Oh man, my favorite fashionable team player suit is filthy. Well, gonna get, you're gonna play dirty, you're gonna get dirty. You can go to the store of fossils, you can make some good money. So, go do that. Other than that, can you get out of the way so I can talk to whoever I need to talk to down here? There we go. So, who's this guy? Did you find him? Uh uh uh. Well, hello there. Looking for fossils as well. Okay, did the player come here? Team, what? A Pokemon? Don't worry about it. Looks like Cleozor and Fat Fossils. You two are very lucky. Just found out two fossils, but both of them I already have, so I'll give you each to you. Draw fossil, sale fossil. We're gonna go with the sale fossil. Um, is this yes? Mm, 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 mm. I'll restore the fossils and turn them back into Pokemon fossils. So we'll see you there. All right, sounds good to me, yo. So, yeah. Well, we we're looking for the assistant and found a suspicious group called Team Flare as well. Guess who's trained and safe to resist the Flare people around? Just in case, let's do a challenge the gist. We can go to the gym now. Let's do that. Hopefully, this is. An escape rope, just what we needed. Because, yeah, I don't feel like going through all that again. So we're going to go ahead and use the escape rope. And go ahead and challenge this gym. Let's go. Let's do this. All right. So we're out of there. We're going to go ahead and jump back on Rhyhorn And head to the gym. da 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 da, -da. Do, 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 do. Oh, what is that? That's a hippopotamus. Hippocos. Well, sorry, dude. We gotta go. We're not trying to deal with all that. We got a gym to challenge. And we're about to put in work on this gym. Something can learn Shadow Claw. I, I don't know what I would, who I'd teach Shadow Claw to. Hmm. Maybe, um, maybe grow vile. Yo. Come on. Come on, hippo potato. Kind of does look like a potato. If I ever caught one of those and used it, it would name it Mr. Potato Head. Alright, so we should be just about out of here. And we'll be able to challenge the gym, which I'm looking forward to. All right, later, Rhyhorn. Thanks for all your assistance, bro. Wait, no, we want to get off. Okay. All right, so let's go. No, we don't want to get, dude, what are you doing? Stop, stop making me jump back on. All right, that was annoying. So yeah. Let's go ahead and challenge this gym. And let's see what happens. First, we're going to go heal up real quick. And go to this gym and see what, what's good. Um, I'm actually going to trade out uh, the, the combi. Um, we're going to go ahead and use uh, that Tarantum that we got. It's level 20. Nice. So Tarantum is going to replace the Combi. Um, no need to level him up because we just take him as he comes. So let me change, um, change this guy to Tarantum. Mm -mm. Oops, sorry about that. Alrighty. And, oh, that's not it, right? That's his evolved form. 
Da, da, da. Tyrant. Damn it. Tyrant. There we go. So we got Tyrant on the squad. And we are going to go ahead and go challenge this gym. And see what happens. So now we're gonna have to battle a couple people up here. This is God's mission for you. Oh, cool. Well, thank you. Cool. Challenge this person. Do, do. And Pokemon man has has just, you know, evolved so much as as just the game in general. Like it's really cool to see how different the games are compared to like, you know, so long ago. I mean it still has the Pokemon feel to it, thank God. That's gonna be annoying. Um but overall I feel like they've just grown so much and changed like, you know, for the better i mean i know people like been waiting to see pokemon in this kind of 3d for so long and it, you know to see it finally here is amazing nothing short but amazing side duck so yeah we're gonna go ahead and go into grovile grovile is gonna put in that work since this thing is a water type uh, 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 uh. but yeah i really want to see more of the alolan forms i mean i'm really i'm really excited for that to see like how how different they're gonna be and especially with their um, with their you know um, typings man I mean not only do their like you know appearances change but their typings are changing uh, it's it's just gonna be so interesting to see like how people use them in battles and you know just just overall like changes of, that they're making it's pretty it's pretty awesome the battle mechanics still look kind of cool. They're still the same, I want to say, but they, they look a little bit more interesting um, as far as the little, um, you know, animations for the battles. So. Okay, where's the gym at? That's what we're looking for. We want the gym. Did we battle this guy? No. Okay, so let's just go ahead straight to that, to the gym. Take on this gym. Uh, 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 uh. There's Grant right there. Oh dear, if you're here for a bicycle race, I'm afraid that you're too late. Race is over. I took first place. I feel bad that you missed it. Allow me to give you. Hey, got a, got a, got the HM. Let's go. Sign a badge. Battle you. First, you need a badge from the gym. I'll run the city. I'll be waiting for the gym. Challenge me. All right. Well, let's do this. Hope you're ready to get taken out the game, homie. Also, too, how do you guys feel about there not being any gyms in the new region? I mean, I, I don't know, man. I've always loved gym battles, but to kind of see, like, a new challenge is kind of cool, too, at the same time. Um, yeah, so I'm really interested to see how that's going to pan out and how, how it's going to, you know, be overall. Do, 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 do. I really want it to be like, you know, uh, as, as like, you know, as, as it was, you know, before, but to have a new challenge on your hands is always fun too. So we're definitely going to see how it pans out. Oh, they did a lot of damage. That's going to use rock blast. Uh Oh, no, no, no. Oh, oh, thank you. Thank you, Arceus. Holy crap, that would have been bad. Dude, if that thing would have gotten like three off, we... Oh my god, Charmeleon would have been down. We're not leading with Charmeleon anymore. That was probably the stupidest thing. Holy crap. My heart just stopped. Oh. That would have been so bad. Yeah, we are switching up. We are going to be using um, Grovile. Going to leave with Grovile. Oh my god, man. My heart just stopped. Holy crap, we almost lost freaking Charmeleon, dude. That would have been so bad. Oh man, I would have been sad. I would have, I would have been so hurt. 
I'm not gonna lie. Like that would have broke my heart. Like if, if anything were to happen to uh Charmillion, that would have been so sad. Yo, this thing is is uh put, dude, all these Pokemon are putting work on. I think we're under leveled. Oh man. That's crazy. That is crazy. We almost lost Charmillion. We're gonna have to definitely um want to learn Screech. No, nope, we don't need Screech. Alright, so we're gonna go ahead and lead with uh uh Frogadier and Hopefully it does nothing bad happens. I mean, we got potions and everything. Um, I think we're all good, but let me go ahead and lead with Frogadier. That was almost tragic, man. We almost lost Char Charmeleon. That would have been horrible. I would have absolutely died if that happened. Actually, let's go this way because we need to get all the experience we can get. Oh, there's no, oh, it's a dead end. Durr. Durr. Alright. Oh, man. That was a close call. Too close for comfort, man. Oh. Wait, I think there's something this way. Challenge, challenge this person, and we'll challenge that guy up there. But holy crap, you guys, we almost lost Charmeleon like that. That was that could have just happened. Oh, a Soul Rock though, and I think it's kind of crazy how people were speculating that Soul Rock and Luna were gonna be like, like the game Sun and Moon were gonna be based around them. That they were, we're gonna get some kind of like mega evolution of them. We might still, we don't know that yet, but still. I think that's kind of funny though, like people were so like putting so much thought into that. Like, oh, they're gonna be Mega Soul Rock and a Mega uh, Luna. Luna Tone. But I wouldn't be surprised though if they did have those in the game. So they haven't like said anything about there being any Mega Evolutions yet. So, um, which, you know, makes me feel like, man, like, you know, they, since Mega Evolution is so new, like, why, why stop all of a sudden? I know like the Z moves are another thing, but why go into something different when you already have something going on that's kind of, you know, good. But we'll see. I don't I don't know. I don't know if they want to make like a like the, every single Pokemon have a mega evolution. Which I, I think eventually will, but you know, who knows? Mm -mm 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 -mm. No, we don't need round. So yeah. So let's go ahead and keep going. Battle the guy up top, and then we're gonna take on Grant. Um. But first, let me heal up. A rock and roller. The thing's gonna have sturdy watch. So we're gonna lead off with water pulse. I knew it. I knew it. Sturdy. And it's got head, but. And this thing with quick attack and knock it out now we're gonna take on grant let's go I think we're ready so um, let's do this man let's go ahead and take on grant and 
Mm -mm -mm -mm. Might have one more trainer up here, I'm not sure. Yep, one more trainer. We'll take on this guy. And we're going to go ahead and take on Grant. Got a Raya Horn. Raya Horn still looks badass. I mean, even through like all the way through the gens, I mean, he's still one of the coolest looking Pokemon. I think, in my personal opinion, I mean. I just wish they kind of would have like, made it like a, you know, Mega like Rhydon or Mega Rhytheria or something. I think that'd be pretty cool. I wonder if they're going to have like an Alolan version of those two because those would be really cool to see what those would be like. You know, maybe the Ice type or something like that. Oh, it's got Thunder Wave. It's going to make me slow, but we got priority moves, so we're good. Mm -mm. So, yeah, we're definitely going to have to um, heal or parry heal, but we're going to probably lead with Grow Wild just in case. So let's go ahead and take out this Onyx. We're going to be slower than it, though, but we just bind. Not a big deal. There we go. Let's take out the Onyx. Probably level up. No? We didn't even get any experience for that. Interesting. Alright, so let's go ahead and hopefully have a Paralyzed Heal. Oh, we don't. It's crazy. Orin Berry. We're going to give this to um, Frogadier. And we're going to go ahead and get into this next battle. I'm I'm gonna heal up one more time though, so because we are gonna be leading. Mm -mm -mm. Let's probably hit up to a million. All right, so let's go ahead and get into this battle. Take on Grant. I've been waiting in eager anticipation with. Uh, have I been waiting for? For a worthy challenger to appear. It's quite an achievement to have climbed all the way up here. Very impressive, actually. I have a feeling our battle will turn out to be worth wait. I hope you'll show me that your skill as a trainer surpasses even mine. Well, let's roll then, Rockman. With all your little bedazzled jewels in your hair. I mean, I'm not the one to judge, but... Just like your hair, it's a little pretty. So he's gonna uh with the Alamise. That's uh, not Alamise. Um, what the heck is that thing called? Am Amoros. Amorora. Amor Amor <laughs> I can't even talk. It's got Aurora Beam, which should do like nothing. We're gonna hit this thing with Water Pulse, and it's gonna be super effective. Let's go ahead and hit it with another Water Pulse. It's got Takedown. Bum bum. Got the berry activated. This thing should go down a water pulse. And then, um, so Tyrant's out coming out. We're gonna stay in. And we're gonna hit this thing with water pulse. Use bite. Oh, it's so low. And then we're going to switch out. Um, we're going to go into Grovile, actually. Because I know this thing is going to use Bite, and it will be a lot faster than it. Um, oh, that does so much damage. Um, I'm not completely sure if it's Absorb what's going to do anything to it. Um, actually, <laughs> I'm going to go into, dude, who should I go into? Who's going to be able to take damage from this thing? Um, well, uh, I don't want to lose, uh, Grovile, but 
if it comes down to it. I mean, I think we'll be okay. Oh my god, that did nothing. This thing is going to kill us. Unless he uses the potion. Nope. Oh my god, no! <laughs> Don't go grow vile! No! Oh my god, that is horrible. Oh, that's that's so sad. Alright, so we're going to send in Charmeleon. This thing is going to definitely heal up. He's going to use some kind of heal thing. We're going to use Dragon Rage on it. Oh my god, why? No, I know I should have switched out. That was such a dumb move. Oh man, that is horrible. Oh my god. Dude. Probably should have led with Charmeleon. Charmeleon would have taken that thing out. Well, we be missed Grovile. Sorry, bro. God. We lost another companion, man, but we got the badge nonetheless. Oh, man, that is, that is horrible. I mean, we're two and two, man. Two badges and two deaths. Man. Oh, my God. Well, I mean, it will be missed, but we have a, a pretty decent grass type. We need to, I need to level up Fungi, like, quick, because, yeah. Grovile was our, was our, was our person that I was going to, yeah, but he's gone now, so. Oh, my goodness. How did that happen? That's, that's horrible. All right, so we're going to go ahead and go to the Pokemon Center, and we're going to put Grovile into the death box and uh, heal up and then pull out our, our next Pokemon. Um, all right, Grovile, it's been real, man. Got a, oh, no, that's Froggy Deer. Um, I hope you have a good life, bro. You were you were good to us, man. I'll see you later. We released him. All right, so let's go ahead and take out our next friend. Um, I think we already got a water type, so we're gonna take out Venomoth. Um, we're not gonna be able to use Venomoth till till like, well, we actually can use Venom. Well, no, we'll wait till the next gym. So. I need to heal up real quick. Um, we're going to leave off the episode right there. I hope you guys had a good time. I had a great time. It's really sad that we lost Grovile, but it is what it is. And um, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Please, like I said, leave a thumbs up. Sub to the channel. I'll see you guys next episode. Peace.